Hey, Perry here. Another unboxing. We got another set of speakers. These are the QSC K.2 series, and these are the K10.2s, which means they have a 10 point or a 10 inch woofer. Um, I have been using the K. 8.2s uh, in my own rehearsal space for the last uh, couple of months and they're awesome and I'm excited to hear the difference between a 10 inch woofer and an 8 inch. The 8 inch are th I think are great for um, small rehearsals, small rehearsal spaces, which I'm I'm in one right now. I've actually recently combined my office and my rehearsal space, so it works great for that. Um, and these, I believe, these are going to be, you know, just another little upgrade from that. The other thing that is really nice about the eight-inch ones is they're just very, very compact. So, like if you're a acoustic musician um, that's doing a lot of you know coffee shops and stuff like that the 8 inch uh, speakers are extremely easy to handle and they sound great very powerful for being 8 inches um, so yeah these these kind of look a little bit more like you know like a standard rehearsal space speaker or a live venue monitor. Um, they're getting up in size. Um, they definitely feel more su substantial. They're bigger. I'll show you a comparison of the 8 inch uh, speakers and the 10 inch ones. Um, it does have a handle back here. Um, and then of course I think it has basically all the same features you know it's got um, it's got the mic line ends and then it's got the gains uh, for the mic line ends and then it's got a stereo mic in uh, an eighth inch and then as I showed on the uh, video that we talked about these speakers a little bit more in depth it has a, a lot of options in here once you turn this on and you can scroll through and you can set a lot of different uh, options in here and you if you're using one of the touch mix mixers you can actually uh, adjust these uh, settings in the mixer just by connecting the speakers to the mixer so that's really cool um, so yeah comes with the power cord and they're kind of like Everything with QSC seems to be a little bit upgraded from your standard uh, fare, you know, stuff that you would just go into, you know, your local box store and buy. Um, and I think I pointed this out before, um, but just on these, just like a detail, you know, on these... Um, uh, power cords they give you the upgrades you know they give you the nice ones with the, the locking clip you know which is you know I'm sure it might cost them an extra 50 cents to put that on there but you know it's a detail that's worth having you know so um, let me show you um, the comparison between the 8 inch and the 10 inch just in size so here's the 8 inch on the left and um, the 10 inch on the right um, the 8 inch speakers you know they have kind of a feel that's you know compact and you know kind of like you know a solo performer would tote around uh, to gigs and uh, you know small rehearsals couple people uh at a two or three people at a time and the the 10 inch ones are getting to be more like i don't know <laughs> real speakers you know these are 
These are stuff you could use in, uh, and this one comes with a handle. Um, with this, with the eight inch speaker, um, there's no handle on the back. There is a handle on the top, just like there is on the 10 inch one, but no handle on the back, which you don't really need it, but with the bigger size, it's good to have a way to carry it like this. Um, other than that, the construction is very similar. Um, they're very, very high quality in terms of build. Um, I, I really can't find any fault in the finish or, you know, the way they're built. So, so anyway, that's a comparison and we will start to use these 10 inch ones. I'll, I'll give them a run for their money before I, um, before I, uh, set them loose in my other rehearsal spaces and do a comparison and, uh, we'll let you know. Rock on.